Good evening. My name is Jeff. This is Jim. Tonight we're going to be uh, discussing on uh, how to put on heat tape on your pipes under your house so they do not freeze. Jim. Heat tape. You'll have pipe underneath the house. It could be black, copper, CPVC, or galvanized. Any, any, any one of them will work on the application that we're fixing to show you. This, we just happen to choose the PEX pipe because it's the most popular pipe there is. Now, to keep, to keep your pipes from freezing, you need insulation on them. Insulation most of the time will keep your pipes from freezing a lot of the time. But sometimes, no, if it gets down to, what, zero degrees, zero or less, you need heat tape on parts of your pipes. Go ahead, James. Need heat tape. Uh -huh. Electrical tape. The way you start out, you'll start by running your line along the pipe, like so. Uh -huh. and what you'll do is you'll have this on here all the way down your pipe, and what you'll do is at periodic places, like James is fixing to show you, Tape it. Tape it. Yes, sir, Stephen. And also down the line. Right. But you, you have to have, tell them about this, James. This is your thermostat. It has to be on, on your pipe. On your pipes. Tape it, tape it like it should be. We kind of went too long on this right here. Okay, make sure your thermostat is attached to your pipe real good. Tape it on both sides. This is what's going to sense the temperature in your pipe and know when to turn this on to heat your pipe up to keep it from freezing. And are you going to have a drop board? Well, we're going to tell them about plugging it up. Yeah. When you plug it up, as you see, the cord is clear. When you plug it up, it should turn orange. Like this, so. and it did. Now, what right. you're going to want to do is come to see us because we're going to have this insulation in stock. This is three quarter. Uh, actually, this is made to fit one inch copper because you get three quarter hex plus the heat tape, which is going to make it bigger than 7.8, so you're going to need to get a little bit bigger insulation like we have here. And we also sell it half inch thick wall thickness and one inch wall thickness. I suggest the one inch wall thickness. This is what we got here, this thick insulation right here. You really want to do this heat taping where your pipe is close to your crawl hole door, close to uh, any anywhere that's going to get any cold air in it. Don't want to, you're not going to do the whole house with the, with the heat tape. You're just going to do it in a certain area. Now, I'm going to take the insulation. It's already pre-split. James, if you can get that in right there. And you're going to wrap the insulation around the pipe like, like so. And you're going to go on down. It comes in six foot sections. You're going to go on down. You're really, you're not gonna have this sticking out. We just kind of run out of pipe. So we're gonna get an extra right here. Actually, that's not gonna be sticking out like that. Okay. All that's gonna be down in your insulation, like so. <coughs> Go ahead. Once now. you do that, wrap the oh, insulation. When, when is, uh, I'll take it, take it, take it. Oh. The first you gotta take, you see this right here? You gotta pull this off, pull this off, strip it all the way back. This is pre sticky stuff on here. And you just stick it together, stick it together. After you do the whole piece like James is talking about, go ahead, James. You run the electrical tape around it to hold it in place. 
that is PT 101.